Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, this solution we have a times a, the same thing as a squared. That's the same thing multiply here. Alright, that's 5 raised to the power x or squared. Then equals to 60 from here. The next step here, this also follows. When we have a raised to the power m raised to the power n. This same thing as a raised to the power m. At this here we have 5 raised to the power 2x equals to 60 from share. The next step, we take the log on both sides. Here we have log 5 raised to the power 2x equals to log 60 from share. At this next step, we apply the power of log n. When we have log m raised to the power p, the same thing as p log m. At this here we have 2x log 5 equals to log 60 on this side. Then next step we divide this side by log 5. Divide this side by log 5. Also divide this side by log 5. At this here log 5 cancel each other. And this becomes 2x equals to log 60 over log 5 then from here we can also rewrite 60 as 5 times 12 then what we have here becomes 2x equals to log 5 times 12 over log 5 then this follows the law of log when well, we have log a times b the same thing as log a plus log b. At this here we have 2x equals to log 5 plus log 12 over log 5. Then next step here we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 5 over log 5 plus log 12 over log 5 then from here log 5 comes each other we have one left here which implies 2x equals to 1 plus log 12 over log 5 then next step here also 12 can be written as 4 times 5 4 times 3, rather. And here, this becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 times 3 over log 5. Then, this also follows law of logarithm. And we have 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 plus log 3 over log 5. Then, here we separate this into two fractions, and we have 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5. Then, next step here, also, 4 can be expressed as 2 times 2, that's 2 squared. And what we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5. That is, from here, we apply the power of log ring. 2 comes here, and we have 2x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5 then we apply change of this here when we have log a over log b this same thing as log a to base b that is here we have 2x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 
at this here divide both sides by two divide this side by two also divide this side by two here to cancel each other here now we have x equals to one plus two log two base five plus log three base five all over two at this Let's check if this satisfies this given problem. At this point, substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to one plus two log two base five plus log three base five all over two. At this what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2 times also 5 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 over 2 is it equals to 60 on this side then here we have same base multiplying when we have a raised to power n times a raised to power also same power n this the same thing as a raised to power n plus n plus 2n and this becomes 5 raised to power 2 times 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2 this is equal to 60 on this side then this power multiplies and 2 here cancel each other this becomes 5 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 this is equal to 60 on this side that is this follows when we have a raised to the power n plus n. This is the same thing as a raised to the power n times a raised to the power n. And this becomes 5 raised to the power 1 times 5 raised to the power 2 log 2 base 5 times 5 raised to the power log 3 base 5. This is equal to 60 on this side. Then here, yeah, 5 raised to the power 1, that's 5 times. We reverse this two up and we have five raised to the power log two square is five times five raised to the power log three base five this is equal to sixty on this side. That is here we have five times five raised to the power log two square that's four base five times five raised to the power log three base five this is equal to sixty on this side. In this follows, now we have a raised to the power log b to base a which is equal to b. And this becomes 5 times 4 times 3. This is equal to 60 on this side. And 5 times 4, that's 20. 20 times 3, that's 60, which is equal to 60 on this side. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget to step. subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell share this video with your thumbs up and please your comments see you next class and bye for now